What's something people don't know about China's lunar ambition? A new era of space exploration. China is reaching for the stars with plans to build a lunar base by 2035. This ambitious project, the International Lunar Research Station, ILRS, signals China's growing presence in space. The ILRS is open to international collaboration, potentially reshaping space exploration. The moon, our celestial neighbor, holds mysteries waiting to be unlocked. China's lunar base plan signifies a bold step towards unraveling these secrets. The ILRS will serve as a platform for groundbreaking scientific research and future human missions to Mars. This project will push the boundaries of human ingenuity and require cutting-edge technologies. From sustainable energy to advanced life support systems, the ILRS is a testament to human innovation. This endeavor is about expanding our understanding of the universe. It's about inspiring future generations to reach for the stars. The ILRS symbolizes humanity's collective dream to explore the cosmos. The ILRS project is a testament to long-term planning and strategic execution. It's designed to unfold in two distinct phases, each building upon the previous one. Phase 1, from 2030 to 2035, focuses on establishing the fundamental infrastructure. This includes constructing essential modules for habitation, research, and resource extraction. It also involves setting up critical power sources and deploying rovers for exploration. Phase 2 from 2035 to 2050 marks a significant expansion into a sprawling lunar network. Multiple interconnected modules and specialized research facilities will create a thriving lunar community. This phased approach ensures a steady and manageable progression of the ILRS project. It allows for flexibility in adapting to unforeseen challenges and incorporating new technologies. This strategy reflects China's commitment to a sustainable lunar presence. The first steps on the lunar surface are crucial. Phase one of the ILRS will lay the foundation for a permanent human presence. This phase involves intense construction and deployment of essential technologies. Core modules will serve as the heart of the lunar outpost, providing life support, living quarters, and research facilities. These modules will withstand the harsh lunar environment, including extreme temperatures and radiation. Power generation is critical, with advanced power sources like solar arrays and nuclear reactors. Ensuring a continuous power supply is paramount for the success of the lunar base. Exploration is a key objective, with robotic rovers and landers deployed to study the lunar surface. These robotic explorers will gather invaluable data for subsequent phases. The data will help identify suitable locations for future expansion. This phase transforms the lunar landscape into a habitable environment for humans. Phase 2. Expanding the horizon. A lunar network takes shape. Phase 2 marks a significant leap forward in the ambition and scope of the ILRS. The initial outpost will blossom into a sprawling network of interconnected modules and facilities. This expansion signifies a transition from a basic outpost to a thriving lunar community. The lunar network will consist of multiple specialized modules for research, resource extraction, and space tourism. This modular design allows for flexibility and scalability. Advanced laboratories and observatories will enable groundbreaking research in various fields. Resource utilization is key, with technologies to extract and use lunar resources. This includes mining water ice for life support and helium-3 for potential fusion energy. Lunar resources hold the key to a self-sufficient lunar settlement. Technological prowess, powering the lunar dream. Building and sustaining a lunar base demands cutting-edge technologies. The ILRS project drives innovation in power generation, communication, life support, and robotics. Reliable power is paramount, utilizing solar arrays and nuclear reactors. Communication is vital, with advanced systems ensuring seamless data transmission and mission control. Life support systems are crucial, employing advanced technologies to recycle air, water, and waste. These systems minimize the need for resupply from Earth. Developing efficient life support systems is essential for long-duration missions. These advancements are essential for overcoming the challenges of lunar living. A stepping stone to the Red Planet and beyond. The ILRS represents a crucial stepping stone for humanity's future space endeavors. The knowledge and technologies developed will pave the way for Mars missions. 
the Moon serves as an ideal testing ground for technologies crucial for Mars. Challenges like radiation shielding and resource utilization on the Moon mirror those on Mars. Lessons learned will be invaluable for future Martian explorers. The ILRS could serve as a launch pad for missions to Mars and beyond. The Moon's lower gravity makes it more energy efficient to launch spacecraft. The ILRS could host a lunar spaceport, facilitating interplanetary missions. The ILRS will contribute to our understanding of the solar system and the universe.